It's the oldest of questions. What drives man to pit himself against the wild, to challenge Mother Nature herself to a no-holds-barred cage match of epic proportions? Thanks for the warm-up, ladies, but I'm hunting big game today. For Tiger Titheridge, it's to become legend and be crowned this year's Master of Macho. But this year's competition is fierce. Grizzly Lady Bear took the dreaded Lasersaurus down like a clown. Mako Manswim Jr. captured the hyper-cunning Great White Smark. And King Cobra snagged the Emperor of Yetis after a 72-hour toboggan chase. Wait, it looks like this hunt isn't over. Tiger has only one day left to out-hunt them all. And to do that, he needs to catch the one. The only Chupacabra. Ha! You're mine! Oh, uh, uh, hi, Tiger. I think I'm allergic to everything in this jungle. And, um, headlocks. It's here. Don't drop your guard for a second, Weevil. Don't even blink. Not blinking. <laughs> what George say about hunting animals, huh? Tiger and Weevil get naughty fingers. <laughs> it's not just an animal. It's the Chupacabra. Choopy Cooby Doo? What Choopy Cooby Doo? <laughs> no, George. The Chupacabra. It's the trickiest and most dangerous of all Mother Nature's nasties. When the other predators tell scary stories at meat camp, it's always about the Chupacabra. The steaks were gone. The Chupacabra had replaced them with arugula. <laughs> Killer whales were originally land dwellers. Hey, you! Come back here! Help! Weevil? Classic Chupacabra, waiting until we were distracted by the narrator. George, rescue Weevil from Chupikubu! Not so fast, Jungle Pants. But George, save Weevil! This is your fault. You triggered that cutaway with your Chupi Kubu nonsense. Talk like a real person! You are gonna help me avenge Weevil's loss. Tiger! But Weevil not lost yet. He's a goner. I'm really not! He was a loyal assistant. He carried rope like a champ, creased maps like a pro, and operated a microwave like a boss. Rest in peace, little guy. Can someone just please rescue me? You owe me, George. So you'll help me catch this chupacabra that struck poor Weevil down in his prime. I'm still alive! Got it, Leaf Eater. George coming, Weevil! I'll take your naked enthusiasm as a yes. You have to understand, chupacabra is a truly worthy opponent. Nemesis, my arch enemy, my numero uno enemy type guy. But I'll show him Mano a Chupacabra. Tiger, stop car now! Yes! Where is it? Where is the Chupacabra? Baby! What? I trashed my Jeep for fruit! What if Baby Banana gets stepped on, or eaten by monkey, or mistaken for fat, tiny boomerang? It would learn to survive and become stronger! Abandoned by its own kind, the Banana Cub would be forced to face its worst fears and crush them. In time, it would become more than just a banana. A banana to fear, a banana to respect, a macho banana, an alpha banana, making the rest of its kind look like fancy organic plantains. Fierce and noble, yet lonely. Oh, that okay. George Orphan too. I was talking about the banana. 
That's what tough tastes like. We've got a chupacabra to catch. The lair of the chupacabra. Chupi Kubu. Time for a visit from Mr. Catchy and Mr. Sleepy. No, saving better than hunting. Whoa! Forget it, hippie. Man was meant to conquer nature, not make friends with it. He was meant to have an amazing jawline and use muscular words like Chesterfield and ripcord. Not swing through the jungle in a tacky loincloth. Yeah? How tiger hunt without bang sticks? Ha, don't eat them. Meet Goodnight Charlie and Mrs. Bash. They're registered weapons. I have to check them when I fly. If you survive this, I'll be very, very surprised. Oh boy. Here, George, go. <laughs> As if. What in Hemingway's name? Oh, hi, Tiger. Hmm, you hungry? That chupacabra fellow left me all this delicious food. And boy, he makes a fantastic smoothie. It's good to have you back, Weevil. Hi, uh, thanks, Tiger. Uh, you know I'm bait, right? Of course, that's classic chupacabra, using my own lackey against me. <laughs> I don't know why, but I like the taste of your mustard chupacabra. I've got a place all ready for you on my trophy wall, right between a polar bear and a T-Rex. I see. defeated by gravity. George, I left you behind to get eaten. No, oh, George, no. But in unexpected twist, plant allergic to papaya conditioner George using hair. George always say, Take care of hair, and hair take care of you. Okay, but you still saved someone more fundamentally awesome than you. Why? Because George Orphan 2. <laughs> George left alone in jungle with no one in world to help. Until it found George. My, aren't you cute and hairless? Only difference between George and Tiger is George had ape. What if Tiger was saved by Big Monkey too? Maybe he'd be nicer person. Blah, blah, blah. Get this straight. I don't need saving from nature. Nature needs saving from me. <laughs> Chupacabra, but get a load of a real man's pits. <laughs> Boom, and that's how it's done. Meet this year's master of macho. Come on, Weevil. Tiger, sure he won't do that? Give Chupi Kubu second chance so Monster can change ways and live new life. <laughs> Get out of 
of here, you beautiful monster. Tiger? Happy now? George, proud of Tiger. I didn't say shut up about your mushy, hippie feelings. I don't even get a trophy now. Tiger still get trophy. Like a golden pat on the back and a first place kiss on the cheek. I am the master of macho. Good for Tiger. Turns out king of the jungle trumps emperor of the yetis. How long George have to stay here? Until next year. At least George have company. Is that papaya in your hair? I think I'm allergic. Mother. <sighs> it's a beautiful morning in the jungle as its inhabitants wait to face another day of fighting for their very survival. Hey, get off me! We had a deal, Bernard! Oh, oh! That's how it's gonna be! Fine! Is your spleen ticklish, huh? <laughs> <laughs> okay, Magnolia, get it together. You're living the dream. Nothing like the life of a jungle scientist. Ah! Nope. Nope. Nuh uh. Two weeks in a row. Oh. Ah! You can do this. You're tough. You're ready. You're a jungle scientist. You're Magnolia! Why? Why does everything here hate me so much? Oh. Mmm. <gasps> Thank you, Patrick. Uh... George? <laughs> Magnolia, please have nice time, too. <laughs> oh, Are you okay, Magnolia? I don't belong here. No one belong in Snake. No, I mean, you all belong in the jungle. I don't. I'm just a science geek in bad cargo shorts. Even the quicksand has it out for me. No, you part of jungle, just like us. Indeed. All you need is a little cheering up. What I need is to go back to my tent, have a cry, and write my resignation letter. Hey, right. We take you for super cheer up jungle fun trip. I really don't want to. Do it. How did you? Don't worry about that. We're here for fun. Cannonball! Wait! <laughs> that one's full of piranha! <laughs> <laughs> it okay, Magnolia. Piranha good pals. See, we all jungle friends. Well, okay then. Cannonball! <laughs> Oh, me forget they like foreign food. Mmm, oh. tasty lunch. Dig in, Magnolia. They're organic and free range. Have these ever been tested? I mean, how do you know if they're safe to eat? Mm. Oh, George eats some city with Tiny George. Mm. No problem. And we apes have enjoyed burger trees for generations. Okay. Mm. You guys are right. It's delicious. <laughs> How were you to know you were allergic? I should have guessed. 
Wait, what's this? Some secret I'm not jungle enough to know? Yes, I mean, no. No, 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 no secret. We were just discussing what fun place to go next. Yes, come now, come. This is dumb. I should just go. <laughs> hey, wait, I've never been to this part of the jungle before. Hey, I, I don't know where I am. <laughs> Great! Just one more reason why I don't belong here. Even my so-called friends forgot about me. I'll go back to my tent and then back to the city. Which way is my tent? That way? Uh-oh. Uh, oh, maybe through there. No, no, it, it's got to be past that tree. Huh. What's he looking at? Whatever it is, must be delicious. It's me, isn't it? I'm delicious. <laughs> okay, okay. I know we went south this morning, so my tent has to be north. Uh, okay, lucky compass. Don't fail me. No! No! North! North! How do I find north? And... You're a magnet! Why is my life so hard? There's got to be a way across. Use those degrees, Magnolia. If I pluck a feather from that bird, it'll squawk and wake up that snake, which will push over that rock, which will roll and knock over that tree, then domino those trees and make a bridge across the chasm. Yes! I knew Jungle Physics 202 wasn't a waste! I hate physics! Go! I like it either, buddy, but it's the only way. Where's your spleen? Yes! Ha! Take that! What you gonna do now, pussycat, huh? Fly! Just go log to log. You can do this. Oh my gosh, the teeth! How can I tell the logs from the crocodiles? Oh, I hate you, evolution! My piggies are so blistered, I bet I can feel the difference. Log, log, croc! Log, croc, croc, croc! Log, log! Ha! Personal high five! Hey! That's not fair! You're not even symbiotic species! Just leave! Because tigers never give up the hunt. They're jerks like that. Ape? You've been here the whole time, you fuzzy little... No! What? Oh. Oh! I get it. This is where I go nuts from being alone and starving in a cave for a month. <laughs> Maybe crazy only way survive. <laughs> Not stupid, smart! You smart to hide in here. Except you not notice jungle vending machine. That's kind of dumb. Magnolia smart about science and jungle. So use brain thinky thing one more time to beat Tiger. Me believe in you. What do you know? You're just a pile of rotten coconuts. But maybe, maybe you're right. What kind of jungle scientist would I be if I let this jungle beat me? Ah! 
It's go time, baby! you with a little celebration of your jungle anniversary. But you forgot me in the jungle! We just needed a little time to set up your surprise party. I was lost for six months! Yeah, we think that's strange too, especially since we only lose you over there. And left you a map, food, and an arrow pointing this way. But wow! You survive alone for six months? You as jungle as us for sure. Let's put that to the test. But run! Ah! 